Welcome back to Morning Break. This one is for all the Swifties out there. Are you a fan of Taylor Swift's music? Yeah, I'm amazed by her. Yeah. I mean, you know, and this tour is, is remarkable what's going on. And I will say that I don't know a lot of her music, but everything I've ever heard by her, I've kind of liked. It's good. She puts out good music for sure. Yeah. And Taylor Swift's tour will be back in the States soon. And her biggest fan is counting down the days until she can see her. I want to introduce you, you all, to Swifty Mickey, <laughs> a four-year-old girl who is more than deserving of seeing her hero live in concert. You got it. No. You're okay. I'm right here with you. No. Ready? Do another one. Tackling new challenges okay. with her mom by her side. No, I don't. I won't. Go ahead. It's something Mickey knows how to do all too well. I think I got it. You got it? Okay, come on. That's because she becomes more fearless day by day. Yep. Be brave. Yeah! You did it. And just like her mom, Jessica Scollert, holds her hand at the oh playground, goodness. she's also been right by her side during one of the biggest challenges a four-year-old could face. Yeah, so she was diagnosed with acute lymphoblastic leukemia on February 9th of this year. Um, it's been a bit rough adjusting to all the hospital visits and the treatment. Um, she's handled it pretty well. Despite the diagnosis, Mickey still keeps a smile bigger than the whole sky. You did it! She's super brave and I'm very proud of her. She's handled all the terminology well. Like she'll tell you I have cancer and I have a port and you know I get chemo um, and she's only four. Music has been somewhat of an escape throughout this journey. That song is called Fearless, a title that describes them perfectly. It's by an artist Mickey can't get enough of. Welcome to the Eras Tour. Taylor Swift. Always in the car. If I don't have a plane, she's like, Mom, put on Taylor Swift. So. Mom, put on Taylor Swift. Yeah. yeah, hearing her on the radio is cool. But Mickey has bigger aspirations. What did you wish you could go do? Taylor Swift concert. Hug. She's the best. She's the best. Yeah, I read it on uh, my book uh, all the time. How people send it to me. People sent you some books, huh? Yeah. Yeah, to flip because they know I got cancer. Yeah. I want to go all the way down and hug her. And hear the songs live that right now live on her wrist. Tell her what this one This one says, Are You Ready For It? Yeah, my favorite song. The Man. Yeah, my favorite. And the Anti hero. But if you're a fellow Swifty, you know tickets can sometimes be untouchable. I did try and get tickets through the you know, pre sale code and Ticketmaster uh, well, without any luck. But well, um, I did find some um, for resale that were quite expensive. But I did go ahead and just purchase them. And then I did the GoFundMe in hopes that I could raise the money to pay for the tickets. As you can see, they still need about 3000 more dollars in order to pay for the tickets. It's a price tag for a priceless opportunity. So Taylor Swift does in her concerts, huh? To make Mickey's wildest dreams come true. She's been through so much this yeah. year. Um, I and didn't want to do she's all it. She's got two more um, treatments coming up where she's in the hospital for 28 days at a time. Um, that's going to be hard on her as well. And so I just really want to make that happen for her. And I think it would be really incredible for all that she's been through to be able to experience something like that. And with that voice, the next time you hear a Taylor Swift song, you may remember her biggest fan, too. They were such Aww. a sweet family. The bond, the bond between Mickey and her mom, Jessica, is just Aww. amazing. Contagious smile, too. Um, it was really nice. Yeah, what a sweet little girl. Uh, you know, she understands way too much uh, for a four-year-old. Yeah. You know, so hopefully she gets uh, the opportunity to see Taylor Swift. And just the idea of doing that, I'm sure, is giving her a lot of hope. Absolutely. And one thing that I want to make sure I tell the audience that Jessica told me is even if you can't help them with the tickets, prayers are yeah. so important right now. She's like, we literally feel when people are praying for wow. our family. So it's, it's, it's really touching and um, definitely wishing them the best. Yeah, and I can't wait, wait to see her <laughs> um, go see Taylor Swift. <laughs> well, coming up on morning break, if you have a child with a big voice,